Um, obviously, what I've got to be most proud of is the fact that as a boy, he's capped three times by England schoolboys. Tia, um, although they are England caps, the caps are actually in the colour of the opposition. I never saw my dad play. Um, his last game was in 1955. I was 18 months old, so I never saw him play. So whenever I meet people who come to these sessions, like the gentleman today who says, I saw your dad play, he was a lovely footballer, that puts the hairs on the back of the neck. The only thing you got out of the club, you got presented by the directors a silver cigarette box. Again, engraved by the directors for 25 years service. It's out there as memories for the oldest supporter and it's also an education to the younger supporters who don't remember what football was like pre-Sky. Um, but more importantly, um, because of the nature of the, the age of some of these items, and Dad played in the 40s and the 50s, a lot of people who went to see him play, of that, of that age group now, unfortunately, um, suffer from dementia. Uh, and I was seconded by um, a couple of support services um, action on dementia based in Sunderland and the Essence Service also based in Sunderland um, and what I do is I put on displays like this but at the same time we also hold um, sessions whereby we uh, basically talk and reminisce and bring back the old days for the dementia sufferers. Mm -hmm.